It's Friday night. It's another episode of the Minecraft Cursed Image series on the channel. I say that so fondly now because that's just basically anything that's sent to me these days. And yeah, <laughs> please keep sending them to me. Now, this is your double crafting table. This is your normal crafting table. You can still craft whatever you want on it. There's your diamond sword. There's your diamond pickaxe. But I don't want to show you guys that one. This is boring. This is normal. This is the monster crafting table. So if you have any suggestions you want to share with me, tweet them to me. You can post a comment. You can also leave any submission that you want on my subreddit, r slash phoenixsc. So just to go over what this double crafting table actually is, I'm just gonna middle click on it. You can see that it's, you know, a giant crafting table. Nothing special there. You can see it from my angle here. It's pretty big and it's not very comfortable to hold. But you won't be carrying this thing around because it's not normal. And who would want this anyway? You can craft your normal diamond pickaxe because it's still a crafting table. There we go. Let's throw that over here. You can also put two plus one to get a diamond sword. And here is your diamond shovel. So there are a few examples just to show you that the normal functionalities are still there. However, why would you bother doing that on a 6x6 six six crafting table? It doesn't make sense. That's just a waste of power. The first thing you can do is craft a long diamond pickaxe, like so, and it appears over here. Click into it, and I'll show you what you can do with this gigantic pickaxe in a little bit. I skipped the diamond sword one because I thought about, you know, a stubby diamond sword or a long sword, and it's kind of normal, so I didn't really want to do that one. The second one here is a massive diamond shovel and it's even bigger or it's even longer than a diamond pickaxe so pick your favorite I've got one more and for a similar reason I didn't do the diamond axe one because a long axe kind of looks you know it's a melee weapon it probably is useful in some capacity these guys the diamond shovel and the diamond pickaxe are ridiculously stupid so what does that leave that leaves the diamond hoe the very long diamond hoe click that in and there we have it. So I'm going to put these into the hotbar so you can see them uh, in action from the third person view and the first person view. So this is what it looks like to hold the long diamond hoe. I don't know, man. It still works properly, but it looks so weird when I use it. It's like you're smashing it into the ground in a very weird angle. That should really be breaking your arm, but it doesn't. So there's that. There's also a very long shovel. It's kind of oversized, but it's a very long handle and you wouldn't want to be holding this because... Unless you want a good workout, there you go, but very inconvenient, very impractical, looks kind of like a mini spatula. I just spent the last five minutes googling it and I couldn't find the name, so maybe you guys can tell me, but this doesn't look like a shovel, it shouldn't be a shovel. But there is the giant pickaxe that you can see, um, it reminds me of the one that's- whoa, I didn't actually see it from this angle, it looks kind of cool. You can see the depth of it from the shiny side on the top, but yeah, it reminds me of that Sethling video that he made years ago, the giant pickaxe but now you can craft it from this giant crafting table and now you can break things with it i'm in creative mode but you get the point this is really stupid but there we have it this is what you guys send me and i made it in the game so there we have it this is the giant crafting table that is completely functional but who would want this thing it's just the same <laughs> Same pickaxe. It's the same pickaxe. There's no extra functionality to it. But anyway, that's what I did, and that's what you guys get today. So thank you all for watching. Leave a like, subscribe for more creative content and cursed Minecraft images. There aren't that many command blocks here, but it's all from functions because it's a lot easier for me to copy paste a lot of things. It did take a while for me to do this, but it's not one of the harder ones. It's definitely one of the weirder ones though.